add transparency to your gradients in Pixelmator Pro. In Pixelmator, go to the Gradient fill in the Tools panel. With that selected, then go up here to Gradient Fill. You'll notice you've got a number of different gradients. You can click here and select any gradient that's available. But you can also modify existing gradients. So go up here and click on this first stop. And you can change it to blue. Now this doesn't affect the preset. You can also go over to this side, click here, and then change that maybe to orange. But you can also click along here. So click little plus there, and now click here to bring up the color picker again. And you can choose from the swatches. So select a swatch, click again, and then click here, and then go here and set another color. But also what you can do is you can go to this end, and you can see here you've got opacity. You can reduce that down. You can make it 50% all the way down to 0%. You can also go to the other side, click here, and again, exactly the same place, just click here and drag this down to 0%. Or well, once you've done that, you can now go to the document and I'm just going to apply the gradient. Now, by default, it's using linear. And you can see there you get this lovely linear effect very quickly. You can also apply it in a radial. So radial, and you get a lovely ring effect. And you can see then, lovely clear through the center of that ring. And you can apply this multiple times. You can also apply a nice black color at the edge as well. Simply go up here, click here. Instead of orange, just go for black. And then when you do that, you see now you've got a black edge. Again, go for radial. And then you can see you've got a lovely shadow effect on the edge of your gradient. Now, if you want to save this, you can quickly go up here. Just go here, click here. And with that, what I want is my section here, my category, Andrew 1. Andrew 1, simply go to plus, click there. And now you can see you've got your gradient. So you can now apply it in the future.